Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. About to get underway here in Eureka. Uh, Eureka Horn is going to be playing uh, IVC Grey Ghost. And just about to get things underway here. So, first, we're going to go ahead and get you line up for IVC here. Up first, uh, number 15, Wheeland. Second, number 7, Thurling. Uh, number, uh, sorry, third up is number 6, Kubelston. Uh, then uh, number one, Smith. Then number 14, Lingenfelder. Number five, McMorrow. 11, Odom. Uh, then number 10, Wrestler. And in the nine hole, number two, Rashid. And now to get to the defensive lineup for the Hornets. Uh, on the mound today is going to be Frank. Behind the plate, Strite. Over at first base, Helsher. Second base, Schmidt getting the start over there today. Shortstop is going to be Bell. Third base is going to be Messer. Left field will be Gregory. Center field will be uh, Lind. And right field will be Berger. And uh, Anderson's going to hit for Lind out there in center field. And just about ready to get things underway here. And the first batter Frank's going to see here is number 15, Wheeland. As we get set on this uh, foggy day. Here he gets set for his pitch, up high, 1-0. Oh. Now he gets ready with the 1-0. Oh. Horn's looking to bounce back after a loss last night, and that one's going to be in there with a swing and a miss. 1-1. One one. Once again, the uh, Hornets, as he gets ready with the 1-1, one one, weren't the most defensive sound team. Now here comes the 1-1 one one pitch, and sent up into center and right field. It looks like Berger will call him off and make the catch. Four out, number one. But as I was saying, uh, final score was just a couple runs separated them, and uh, they Hornets walked in a couple, and uh, errors uh, from the outfield got in another run. So hopefully we can nip those in the buds as number seven uh, Thuler comes up now, or sorry Thurling, and first pitch is in there for a strike, 0-1. Now he gets set with the 0-1. And swung on one in the dirt there. Got him 0-2. And we have had a couple of uh, defensive shifts. It uh, seems Schmidt has shifted over to second base, as I said, as he gets ready with the 0-2. Misses just a bit there. <clears throat> and uh, Master's playing third now. So we'll see how that works out today as he gets set with the one and two count. Now here it comes. Whoa, way outside. Two and two. Now he gets set with the two and two. And here comes pitch. Misses up high. Full count. And so full count now on him. Here he gets set with it. Here comes the pitch. And sent it sky high. Frank underneath it. And looks like Strike's going to. Oh, Strike's going to actually call him off but can't snag it with the glove. Didn't get quite underneath it there. And those catcher mids, obviously, a uh, different shape, so you're not quite used to catching a pop fly like that. So it will end up being a foul ball. Still stay at three and two count. One out here. Top of the first. So it gets ready with the three and two now. And here comes the pitch. And sent out a play foul on the first base side. A little late on that one was number seven here. Still going to be a full count. And now he gets ready. Here comes the pitch. Call. Strike three. Got that outside corner. And that's going to be out number two here. So two up, two down for number six. Culverston coming up to bat. As he steps in now, lefty. As he gets set, first pitch, sent out there into right field. But he was a bit too early on that one as it ends up in foul territory. So 0-1 count on him. Now he gets set with the 0-1. And there comes the pitch, sent straight back towards us, make it 0-2. So way ahead of him here with an 0-2 count. Two outs here, and the top of the first. Here it comes. Couldn't get him to chase, just a bit outside. 
So it's going to be 1 and 2 now. So 1 and 2 now. As you get set, here comes well inside on that one. So going to end up being 2 and 2 on them. So it gets set with the 2 and 2. And now here comes the pitch. And the dirt. Full count. So the batter worked it from 0-2 to 3-2 and now. Hopefully Frank can put him away. He already got a fly out and a strikeout as he gets set with a 3-2. and And here comes the pitch. And got him swinging at one high there. So that's going to do it here for the top of the first. 1-2-3 goes. IVC will go to the bottom of the first. So Bell will start things off here for the Hornets in the bottom of the first. As their pitcher gets set with it. Here comes the first pitch. Playing down a bunch, but doesn't make contact. So it will be 0-1 on Bell now. Rest of the Hornets uh, offensive lineup. It goes Bell, Frank, Schmidt, Berger, Helscher. As he gets set with the 0-1. And going to be sent out of play on the first base side, 0-2. Uh, as I said, uh, yeah, so it will be in the sixth hole, uh, Messer, then Gregory, Strite, and Anderson's hitting for Lind as he gets ready with the 0-2. Here comes the pitch. Missed a little bit up there, 1-2. So 1-2 count on Nick Bell now, leading things off for the Hornets here. Back in that leadoff spot, here comes the pitch, and sends another one out of play. Stay right here at 1-2. and two. Now he gets set with the 1-2. Here comes the pitch. Oh, got him with an off speed there. Going to be the first out here for the Hornets in the bottom of the first. So Matt Frank comes up now. One on, none or sorry, one out, none on. First pitch to him is going to be in the dirt. 1-0 count. So he gets set with a 1-0 now. And here comes the pitch. Going to be a little roller out there on the third base line, but it'll get out of play foul. So 1-1 one one on Frank now. So he gets set with a 1-1 count now. And here comes the pitch and the dirt. Two and one. So two and one count on Frank here. One out, bottom of the first. Here comes the pitch. Well outside. Three and one. Now he gets set with three one. And here it comes. Gonna be a little, another roller out to third base, but it'll get foul as well. So full count. So full count on Frank here as the pitcher gets ready with it. And now here comes the pitch. Called strike three. So back to back looking there from the horn. It's got to get the bat off the shoulder. As Schmickall steps up to uh, bat. Two outs, none on. So Schmickall steps in now. Here comes the first pitch to him. Going to be sent out to first base. Does that get foul? So 0 1 on him now. So he gets set with the 0 1 now. Here comes the next one. And that all out of play on the first base side. 0 2. So in the hole here, 0-2, and two. as he gets ready with it. And here comes the pitch, called strike three, so three straight strikeouts looking for the Hornets. And that's going to do it here for the first game. We'll go to the second, still scoreless. So about to start the top of the second. Well, first here is going to be number one, Smith. As Frank gets ready out there, whoa, well inside, 1-0 count. Now he gets set with the 1-0. And here comes. It's going to be high this time, 2-0. So 2-0 on him now. And he gets ready with it. And misses up high, 3-0. So a 3-0 count on him now. As he gets ready with it. And that one's going to be inside. So four straight to lead things off here in the second. So it brings up number 14 here, Lingenfelter. As there goes that runner, going to be swinging a miss. Throw down to second base. Looks close. It's in time. Good throw there from Strite. Uh, and a real good tag from uh, Bell out there. And that'll be the first out now. And an 0-1 count on the batter up here. You know, you get set with the 0-1. Here it comes. It's going to be sent out there to Messer. And a diving stop. Throw to first. Going to have to pick it in. Great pick there by Helscher. Good play all around. Diving over there is Messer at third. And Helscher with a real good pick play over there at first. Makes it two outs now. And nobody on. For uh, number five, 
McMorrow coming up to bat. So now here comes the first pitch, and nice one there, as that's going to get across for a called strike, 1 Now he gets set with the 0-1, and, and oof, man, just missed there, 1-1. One one. So 1-1 one, one count on him now. As Frank gets set, here comes the pitch, and that one's in the dirt, 2-1. and one. So 2-1 two count on him now, two outs. Here in the top of the second inning, here comes the pitch and sent out there into center field. And it looks like Lind will be able to make the catch, so that's going to do it here. Good play all around from the Hornets. We'll go to the bottom of the second. Hopefully, we can get on the scoreboard. So, up here uh, for the bottom of the second, leading off things for the Hornets is going to be Berger. As he gets set without there. And now here comes the first pitch to him. Sent out of play, foul on the left side. 0-1 count. Now he gets set with the 0-1. And going to be sent out there between shortstop and third. Shortstop goes over, but he bobbles it a bit. No throw, and that's going to be the first base runner for the Hornets today. So an error by the shortstop. Has Berger over there at first. And is going to bring Helser up to bat. No outs. One on. Berger again, the next step over there. As he gets set, here comes the pitch. Right down the middle, 0-1 count. So he gets set with the 0-1 now. And here it comes. Oh, a little late on that one from Helsher, 0-2. So behind here, 0-2. As he gets set, here comes the pitch. Misses up high, 1-2. and two. So 1-2 and two count on Helsher now as he gets set with it. Checking over here at first base, but it comes to the plate. And misses up high, 2-2. Two and two. So he gets set with a 2-2 two and two count now. And now here comes the pitch. Misses up high, three and two. So three and two count on Helsher here as he gets set with it. Here comes the pitch and sent out of play, foul. So we'll stay right here at three and two. So he gets set three two count now, once again. And there goes Berger and swing and a miss and the catcher had a stutter throw there. So Berger is able to get into scoring position, but there will be one out now. So Mester comes up now, runner in scoring position. Second and short base both really playing up the middle. And there goes second base back to his regular position. And first pitch to Mester is a little bit low there, 1-0. Oh. Now he gets set, 1-0 oh count. One out here. And now throws back to second base, close one, but Berger just gets his hand in there. So still be a 1-0 oh count on Mester here. One out, bottom of the second. Got a scoreless game right now between Eureka and IBC. As he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. Called strike. So make it one and one. So one and one count on him now. As he gets ready with it. And about to, about to second, but he comes to the plate. And whoa! Sent into IBC's dugout. Hopefully everyone's all right down there. So it looks like everyone's all right. It's still going to be a 1-2 count on Messer here. Berger out there at second base. As he gets set with it. And misses up high, 2-2. Two and two. Now he gets set, 2-2 two and two count. Here comes the pitch. And sent out of play on the uh, first base side. So still going to be a 2-2 two and two count here. So he gets set once again with a 2-2. Two and two. And here comes the pitch. Swung on and missed. Another strikeout. And that's going to be two outs now and brings up uh, Gregory. So Wade steps in here. Still got that runner out there at second base. Hopefully Wade's able to bring him in here as he gets ready with it. And here comes the pitch. A little bit high. 1-0. Oh. Now he gets that with the 1-0. Oh. And this is a pie 2-0. So, 2 and on one Wade here. Straight waiting on deck. And big cup, it came up empty. 2-1. and one. So, 2-1 two count on Wade now. Two outs. Burger out there at second base. And now it comes a little bit low. 3-2. and two, Or, sorry, 3-1. and one. So, 3-1 count on him here. And here comes the pitch. Going to be sent out foul. So, have a full count here on Gregory. So, Wade's got a full count on him now. And here comes the pitch. Going to be a little roller out there to first base. First base gets it, takes it himself, 
And that'll do it for the inning. The Hornets strand one on that error. But, uh, or sorry, uh, I'm going to send it to the third. Still a scoreless game. So about to start things here in the top of the third inning. Uh, first is going to be number 11, uh, Odin. As Frank gets ready, here comes the first pitch. Going to be sent out there into center field. Shallow, though. Bell's going back. And, oh, off his glove. So, uh, air to start the inning there. You'd hope uh, Lynn would call him off there. A harder catch for the shortstop, obviously, trailing back. Either way, though, it's going to be a one on and none, on, uh, none out here. For number 10, uh, wrestler coming up to bat. So he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. And nice block there by Strike. Well outside. It was about to be a wild pitch, but he was able to uh, hop over and get it. 1-0 count, though. Now he gets set with the 1-0. And he's throw to first. He's back in plenty of time. So once again, gets set with, with the 1-0. Uh, oh. Master creeping in over here at third base as he uh, about to lay a bunt, but brought it back. Either way, though, it's going to be called a strike. 1-1. One one. So he gets set with a 1-1 one one count now. And once again, tries to lay down the bunt, but this time it'll get out of play foul. So 1-2 on him now. So 1-2 count on him now as he gets set with it. And there comes pitch, and sent up the middle, but uh, Schmickall is going to be able to catch it out there and throw it to first. Double play, great out there by Schmickall. Heads up as that runner at first base thought that one was going to get through, but Schmickall had different plans, so all of a sudden, two down here, nobody on for uh, number two, Rashid, coming up to bat. As Frank gets set with it, here it comes. A little bit outside, 1-0. So he gets set with a 1-0 now. And that one comes right across the plate, 1-1. One one. Now he gets set with a 1-1 one one count. And going to be roller over there to first base. And Helsher will take it himself. So even though they have a base runner, that double play really helps out. And then a little ground ball that's going to be it. We'll go to the bottom of the third, still scoreless. So Stride will be up here first in the bottom of the third. As he gets set with it, first pitch is sky high. Third base coming in, and it'll just get out of play as it hits the top of the Hornets uh, dugout there. Strike gets second life here, 0-1 count on him. Now he gets set with the 0-1. And here it comes, and send a little fly ball out to first base this time, and it's going to be caught by the first baseman. So one up, one down here in the bottom of the third. And that'll bring up uh, Anderson now. So Anderson comes up to bat now. And first pitch, he takes it's a bit high there, 1-0. Oh. Now he gets ready with the 1-0 oh count. And misses outside this time, 2-0. Oh. Now 2-0 oh count on Anderson here. Here comes the next one. And a little too far inside, so 3-0. Oh. So 3-0 oh count on Anderson now. And here comes the next one. That's going to be right down the middle, 3-1. and one. So a 3-1 count on him here. As he gets set with it, here it comes. And late on that swing, 3-2. and two. So now it's going to be a 3-2 count. And looks, it called strike three. That'll be two outs now here in the bottom of the third. Roll over our lineup. And uh, Nick Bell will come up. Let's see steps in here. First pitch, right down the middle, strike one. Now you get set with the 0-1. And here it comes. Misses a bit high there. One and one. So Bell's got a one and one count on him here. Two outs. Bottom of the third. Trying to get something going as he gets set. Here comes the pitch. And it'll take strike number two. So one two on Nick Bell now as he gets set with it. And now here comes the pitch. And going to be a little roller over there to first base. First base is going to take it himself. And that's going to do it here. For the bottom of the third, we'll go to the fourth. Real quick game here. Both pitchers seem to be on as we go to the fourth inning. Still 0-0. So about to start the top of the fourth here. Frank's still out there on the mound. And uh, 
I'm going to start at the top of IVC's uh, lineup here. Number 15, Whelan, comes up. He flew up his first time, and it looks like he might fly out here as it's out there and do left field. Oh, and left field and right collide. As now he's going to try for three, and it's going to be a close play at third. Safe in third as he beats the throw. So it uh, looks like Gregory and Lynn didn't have real great communication out there. And that's going to end up having a runner over here at third to start the fourth inning. So that will bring up number seven now. Who uh, struck out looking his first time. Frank could really use that right here. Got no outs runner at third. As he gets set, first pitch. Whoa, well outside. 1-0 count. So now he gets set with the 1-0. Here comes the pitch. And it'll be a roller out there, but it gets foul to make it 1-1. One and one. So he gets set with a 1-1 one and one now. And here comes the pitch. And sent out there into the right center field. That'll drop. And that'll be a run for IVC. Make it 1-0 on that uh, RBI single there. So 1-0 uh, now. We're going over at first. Still no outs here for number six coming up to bat. As he gets set, first pitch, even though he showed Bunny, brought it back, and that one was a bit too high. 1 0. Now he gets set with the 1 0. And here comes the pitch, high as well, so two straight here. So a 2 0 count here, no outs. And runner at first base. Now he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. Misses again. Three straight. So a three and oh count here. As Frank gets set with it, here it comes. And make it four straight. So now runners at first and second. Still no outs here in the top of the fourth inning. So uh, runners at first and second now. Going to bring up number one, Smith. Corners are in for the uh, uh, Hornets defense here. And now Frank gets ready with the pitch. And here it comes. Well inside. 1-0. Now he gets set. 1-0 count. And here comes the pitch. Right down the middle. 1-1. One one. So a 1-1 one one count here. As he steps back to second base. And that throw gets away from him. So now that runner's going to move over 90 feet, first and third now, still no outs. Now he gets set with a one-on-one -on -one count still. Here comes the pitch, and it's going to be a little flare out there. Schmickall can't grab it as that goes over him, and throw to second base, not in time. So he'll make it 2 nothing. still no outs here, and runner's at first and second. So number 14 steps up to bat here. Corner's still in for the Hornets. As Frank gets set with it. Here comes the pitch. Misses inside, 1-0. So, 1-0 count on him here. Hornets looking for out anywhere at this point. As he gets set with the 1-0, here comes the pitch. And sends straight back out of play. I'm 1-1 one one now. So, 1-1 one one count here. As Frank gets ready with it. Here comes the pitch. Misses outside though, two and one. So a two and one count on him. And now Frank gets ready. Here comes the pitch, and in the dirt, three and one. So he gets ready, three one count. No outs, runners to second and third, or first and second, as the pick play back to second base is real close, but can't get him out. So a three one count here. And here comes the pitch. And going to be a roller out there to Messer. Throws it to second base for one. Smith all bobbles it. Throw to first isn't in time. So one out here now. Runner's going to be on the corner for IVC. And that brings up uh, number five, McMorrow now. So now Frank gets ready with the pitch as he throws over to first. But runner's back in time. So he gets set now, and now they're going to have a runner out there in a pickle, and now they're going to try to come home with it. Got him at home. Good tag applied by strike there. Good throw by Schmick all in home. So two down now.
Uh, a runner is the runner who was at first did get tagged out. Or sorry, at third base did get tagged out. So two down now. Runner at second. He's the one who reached on that fielder's choice. And uh, number five still waiting for his first pitch of the at bat. Here it comes and misses up high one zero. So he gets set with a one zero now. And here comes the pitch. Going to be sent out there into center field. And Lind will woof, make the catch. So that's going to do it here for the top of the fourth. IBC scores two going into the bottom of the fourth inning. So Frank will start things off here in the bottom of the fourth. Horn's got to get those bats alive. As he gets set for his pitch, it's sent straight back foul, 0-1 count. So now he gets set with the 0-1 count. And here it comes. Gets across for a strike, 0-2. So in the hole here, 0 and 2 as he gets ready with the pitch. And here it comes. And called strike three again. So that's going to be one out here. So Schmidt comes up now. One out in the inning. First pitch. Missed a bit inside there. 1 and 0. Now he gets set with the 1 and 0 count. And here it comes. And foul ball. 1 and 1. So a 1-1 count on Schmick all here. One out in the bottom of the fourth. Horn is trailing IVC by two. And here comes the 1-1. One and one, and takes it upstairs. 2-1. and one. So a 2-1 count on him now. As he gets set with it. And misses just outside there. 3-1. and one. So now he gets ready. And here comes the pitch. And sitting right back up the middle. Shortstop not going to be able to make the play. So one out single here by Schmick all. Hopefully the Horns... Will come to life after this. It'll bring up Berger now. Who, uh, back in the second inning, got over to second base, but was not able to be brought home. As he gets set out there, comes the first pitch to him. And sent it sky high, but it'll get out of play. 0-1. So, 0-1 count on him now. As he gets ready with it. And there goes Schmickle. Here comes the pitch. It's outside and catcher can't uh, make the glove to hand transfer there. So one and one count on Berger. Schmickle out there a second one out here. Where it's got to start cashing in on these. Already the bottom of the fourth inning as he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. He ain't going to be a roller out there. Second base going back to try to get it. But he won't be able to. And that's... Uh, Schmickall got the stop sign over there at third base, so going to be first and third now for Helscher coming up. So Helscher steps in here. Good lead over there at first base by Berger. And there he goes, first pitch. Going to be a called strike, throw down to second base. Not in time. So runners at second and third now, still just one out here. And that uh, last pitch that came in was outside, so it's going to be a 1-0 count on Helsher here as he gets set with it. And here it comes, and well outside again, 2-0. So 2-0 count now, and here comes the next one. Misses up high, 3-0. Helsher more than likely taken here as he got a 3-0 count. Messer over there on deck. As he gets set with the 3-0. And here comes the pitch. That's going to be called strike 3-1. So he gets ready with a 3-1 count now. And sends it sky high. Catcher giving chase. But it'll get out of place. So full count on Helsher now. So 3-2 count on Helsher here. One out. Or is the second and third. Big spot here for the Hornets. As he gets set, here comes the pitch. And misses outside. So we're going to be bases loaded now for Messer coming up. So Messer steps in here. Big spot for him. Here's the first pitch. Stays. A called strike 0 1. Now he gets ready with the 0 1. And here comes the pitch. And sent out there. Pass. First and second base. That's at least going to be one. And now, uh, whoa, uh, stop signing. And it's going to be out in the little broken here. But no one ever actually throws the ball. Sorry. He's trying to get across the point that 
Helster rounded second base real hard, and he was coming over to third, but Berger wasn't coming around, so he had to go all the way back. Set, uh, catcher thankfully didn't throw it there. Or that would have been two down. So bring up uh, Wade now. One to two ball game. Hornets just trailed by that one and still have bases loaded and just one out here. So Wade steps in here. Big spot for him. First pitch. Well inside, 1-0. and So he gets set with a 1-0 now. And here comes pitch. Well outside, 2-0. So a 2-0 count on Wade now as pitcher gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. That's a cross for a strike, 2-1. and one. So a 2-1 count now. And it's going to be a little blooper out there. Second base drifting back. Right field coming in. Nobody able to catch it up. And that's going to mean it's going to be 2-2 two two now. And bases still will be loaded there with that RBI single from Wade. So that will bring up strike now. 2-2 two two ball game. Still just one out here. As uh, Strike steps in. Popped out his last time. Hopefully he can... Uh, Get another run up on the scoreboard. Get the Hornets in front. Led up two in the top of the fourth, but got him right back here as he gets set with his first pitch. And now here comes the pitch. And going to be sent out there into center field. Not very deep and not going to send the runner. So that's going to be two down now. So I'll bring up Anderson now. Two down. Base is full of Hornets here. As he gets set with the first pitch, here it comes. And fouls it straight back, 0-1. Now he gets set with the 0-1. Here it comes, 0-2. And swing and miss there. So got a mode 2 here as he gets set with it. Here comes the pitch. And going to be foul ball out there on the first base side. Stay right here at 0-2. So still an 0-2 count here. And here it comes with it. Misses up high. 1-2. So he gets set, one, two count, two outs. Base is full of Hornets here. And here comes the pitch. And that just got a piece of Anderson there. So will make it three to two. And that's gonna give the Hornets a lead. And still gonna have the bases loaded here. So Bell will come up now, base is still loaded. Here comes the first pitch to him. Well high, one and oh. So now the pitcher is out there, gets set with the O and, or sorry, one and oh. And now here comes the pitch. Whoa, well inside, 2-0. Oh. So now he gets set, 2-0 oh count. And here comes the pitch. And right down the middle, 2-1. and one. So he gets set with the 2-1 and one now. And here comes the pitch. And well outside, 3-1. And nowhere to put him here, so... Can be very selected by Bell. As he gets set with the 3-1, two outs. Runners at every base for the Hornets. Here he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. And foul tip there. Make it 3-2. and two. So 3-2 three, count. Reynolds will get a lead start here. As he gets set with the 3-2. and two. And here comes the pitch. And going to be ball four. Good eye there from Nick Bell. Make it 4-2 to two in favor of the Hornets. And bring up Frank now. So after a quick talk on the mound from IVC's coach, they're going to leave this pitcher in. As Frank gets set out there. And here comes the first pitch to him. Misses outside, 1-0. Now he gets set with the 1-0. and Hornets with a four-run inning here. As he gets set. And here comes. And going to be a chopper out there to third base. Third base is going to end up making the tag over there on... Uh, Anderson as he was on his way to third, but the Hornets did damage. Got four in the bottom of the fourth, one of the fifth, up two now. <laughs> Starting things off here in the top of the fifth inning. Up first is going to be number 11, and first ball is well inside there. Going to be a 1 0 count. Now he gets set with the 1 0, and here comes the pitch, and fouled straight back, 1 1. So 1 1 count now from Frank as he gets ready. Here it comes. And Sonata play as well. So one and two. So ahead of him, after those couple of foul balls, as he gets set with it. Hopefully we can get a quick inning here as he gets ready. And that next pitch is going to be in the dirt. One and, or sorry, two and two. 
Hornets had a real good bottom of the fourth after giving up two in the top. Had the bases loaded for a lot of consecutive batters there. As he gets set with the two and two. And here comes the pitch. And once again, sent out a play foul. Stay right here, two and two. So, two and two count. As Frank gets ready with it. Here comes the pitch. And sent straight up. Bell calling everyone off. And he's coming in and able to make the catch. So that'll be out number one here. That'll bring up number 10 to bat now. With one down and nobody on. As Frank gets set, first pitch, foul tip. And that's going to be 0 1 count. Now he gets set with the 0 and 1. And here comes the pitch. Oh, man. Apparently a bit low there. So it'll be a 1 and 1 count. So now he gets set, 1 and 1 count. And that pitch is sent sky high. And it'll get out of play on the first base side. So I got ahead from now 1 and 2. So 1 and 2 count now. 1 out. Top of the fifth. Here comes the pitch. Just misses outside again. So make it 2 and 2. So uh, Frank's got a 2 and 2 count here. And here comes the next pitch. That's called a strike three. Nice one right there on the paint. And that's going to be out number two here in the top of the fifth. That'll bring up number two, Rashid. now. Two down, nobody on. First pitch to him. Tries to lay down a bump, but it goes right back to Frank. Got plenty of time. Throw to first in time. So three up, three down. Real good inning there by Frank. We're to the bottom of the fifth. Hoping to add a couple more onto this two-run lead. So starting off the bottom of the fifth here, up first is going to be Schmickall. He fouls one straight back on the uh, first pitch here. And now the pitcher gets ready with the 0-1. And that's going to miss a bit high. One and one. So one and one count on him now. Here comes the pitch. And fouls another one straight back. Make it one and two. So one and two count on Schmickel here. As he gets ready with it. Four to two game in favor of the Hornets. As he gets set with it. And sends another one out. Foul. So one and two count now. As he gets ready with it. Here it comes. And whoa, that one's in the dirt. Two and two. So, 2-2 two two on Schmickle now. As he gets ready with it. And here comes the pitch. Misses well outside. 3-2. and two. So, now he gets set with the next pitch. And a roller out there to shortstop. But uh, shortstop fumbles it a bit. Throw over. Not in time, even with a great pick over there by first base. So, Schmickle's on with a uh, leadoff single there. And that'll bring up Berger now. Nobody out. One on here. As he gets set with it. Here comes the first pitch. There goes Schmickle. And Berger's taking all the way. Throw down. Not going to be in time. And the second, or sorry, shortstop wasn't even to come up with the catch either way. He was going to be in there safe. So a 1 0 count on Berger here. Schmickle's his second base. Hornets trying to add on to that lead. As he gets ready with that 1 0 now. Now he gets set with it. And just misses outside, 2-0. And, oh. and sorry, correction there, it's going to be 1-1 one one count. So he gets set with it, here comes the next pitch. And taking a bit low there, 2-1. and one. So 2-1 count on Berger now, here comes the pitch. And just misses outside, 3-1 count now. So 3-1 count on Berger here. Ivy Stee still leaving that pitcher out there. Here it comes with 3-1, and Berger rips one, but it goes foul. So 3-2. and two. So 3-2 count on Berger here as a snap throw down to second base, and that's going to get away from the shortstop, but center field there to back it up. So still going to be 3-2 on Berger here. No outs. Schmink all out there at second base. Already a two-run lead for the Hornets here in the bottom of the fifth. Hopefully uh, they can extend that lead as he gets ready with the 3-2. and two. And here comes the pitch, and fouls it off. So we'll stay right here, three and two. So he gets set once again with three and two. Here, here comes the pitch, and a roller out there to first base, but it'll get foul. So we'll stay right here at three and two. So once again, set with the three and two count. And here comes the pitch, and once again, Berger fouls it off. So three and two once again. Berger keeps fouling him off here as he gets set. Here comes the pitch, and he'll foul another one off. 
So Seth still staying in there with a three and two count. As the pitcher gets set, here it comes. And he'll finally take ball four there. So a real great bat there by Seth. Can have him at first and second for Helsher coming up, but it looks like it might be the end of the day for uh, IVC's pitcher here. As their coach goes out to the mound. And it looks like he will be uh, putting in someone else. Can't quite see his number right now, but he'll inherit runners at first and second and no outs. And it'll bring uh, number four. They'll have number four coming in pitch now. After a couple of warm-up pitches, Helsher comes up now. Runners at first and second for him. And no outs here. So Helsher steps in here. Hornets pose for a big inning here as the first pitch comes down. And he tries to bunt it, but it runs too far inside. Going to be a foul ball. 0-1 count. So he gets set with the 0-1 now. And try to bunt again, but didn't get it in play. He's going to go foul again. 0-2. So 0 2 on Hills for now. Here comes the pitch and sent a little bloop out there into left center field. That's going to get down and going to have another bases loaded situation in the Hornets here. Has Schmidt all got the stop sign at third. So 4 2 right now, but Masters coming up with the bases loaded and no outs. And last time he was up, he uh, got a single and eventually came in to score himself. So hopefully he can do the same here as he gets set out there. As the uh, IVC infield's playing in here. First pitch to him, called strike. And they're playing in because if they uh, get hit to him, they'll try to get that double ball from home to first. But when you play that far in, a hard enough ground ball could get past you. So you get set with the 0 and 1. And oh, a foul ball out there on the first base side. So 0 2 on Messer. So he gets set with the 0 2 now. And here comes the pitch. And misses down low there, one and two. So one, two on Messer now. As the pitcher gets set out there. Still no outs, Hornets on every base. And the next pitch comes in and misses high, two and two. So the pitcher gets set with a two and two count. And here comes the pitch, and Messer sends it out there, but once again gets foul on that first base side. So we'll stay right here at two and two. So after that foul ball, still a two and two count. As he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. And a little bloop out there into center field. Center fielder coming on, and he's not going to be able to make the catch. And they're going to send one home and now try to send another. And the catcher doesn't come up with the ball. And now, oh, oh it looks like Messer got off here. And now Helster's going to try to get third base. He gets tagged out at third. But the Hornets do get two runs on that. Uh, crazy play there. A couple of them scored, and then Messer didn't have heads up there. He didn't look and see Helster just standing there at second base. And when he came, uh, Helster tried to take off to third base, but he was thrown out. So one out now. Runner uh, Messer's over there at first after that bloop single, bringing up Wade Gregory. But the score is now 6-2 to two in favor of the Hornets here in the bottom of the fifth inning as Wade steps in. And he gets set with the pitch. And Wade will eventually call time as pitch took a bit too long there. And first pitch to Gregory is called strike. A one count. Gregory got an RBI single his last time up. And he gets ready with the 0 and 1 count now. Now here comes the pitch, and swung on a miss, 0-2. Now he gets set with the 0-2, and, and Wade just fouls one off, stayed 0-2. So still 0-2 on Wade here. Whoa, and that one ran well inside, gets away from the catcher, and Messer will be at second base. 1-2 count on Wade now after getting out of the way of that one. So 1-2 count on Wade here. Here comes the pitch, and a little roller out there to first base. First base takes himself for out number two. And Messer does advance over to third. Now bring him straight to the plate with two down here. Messer over there at third base. Horns already scored a couple this inning. Maybe could get one more here. And here comes first pitch to strike. Takes it in the dirt. 1-0. Now he gets set with the 1-0. Oh. 
Here comes the pitch and chopper. Oh, over the pitcher's head. Shortstop comes up though. Throw it first. Nice stretch by first baseman. And it'll get him here for a third out, but not before Horn score two more. Extend that lead to four runs going into the top of the sixth. Gonna start the top of the sixth here. The uh, first up is gonna be number 15. He takes a ball inside there. Make it 1-0 count. Now he gets ready with the 1-0. And, oh. and here comes the pitch. Check swing, couldn't hold, or uh, he held it back, but I guess it didn't matter as that one was called to strike one and one. Now he gets set with the one and one, and a little bit low there, two and one. Now he gets set with the two one, and right up the middle there, Nick Bell diving, but can't come up with it. So, one on, no outs here for number seven coming up to bat. So, with one on, no outs here, it's number seven steps up. First pitch is outside ball one. So he gets set with a 1-0 now. And here comes the pitch. And sent out there into right field. Berger plays it on a hop. And gets it in quickly. So they're going to be at first and third now. Still no outs here. So uh, DH number six steps into bat here. And it looks like we'll have a talk with uh, Frank out there in the mound. Might have been the last batter he's seen. And it appears Frank will stay in here. So they're going to be runners at first and second. No outs. Hornets lead by four in the top of the sixth here, getting towards the end of the game. So hopefully uh, Frank can keep this one, uh, keep his good streak going right here. So he gets set. And here comes the first pitch. And sky high. That should be an out there. And it looks like we'll call an infield fly anyway. So out automatically. So one out now. As it'll bring up uh, number one Smith up to bat after that pop fly. Runner still at first and second. One out now, though. Now Frank gets set out there. Here comes the pitch. And this is outside 1 0. So 1 0 count. Frank gets set. Checks that runner back to second base. Well, it comes to the plate with it. A bit high, though. 2-0. So 2-0 count now on the batter. Ground ball could get the Hornets out of this as he gets set with it. That's right across for a strike. Is that next one uh, going to make that count 2-1? and one. So he gets set with a 2-1 count. And here comes the pitch. And a bit high there. So 3-1. So 3-1 count now. And here comes the pitch. And that's inside, so ball four. Going to have bases loaded here. Still just one out for uh, number 14 coming up to bat, who's grounded out and reached on a fielder's choice. Grounded out back in the uh, second inning over there to third base. So he steps in here. Corners playing in. And here comes first pitch from Frank, and little bloop out there. It's going to be a tough one, and it's going to get down, and they're going to try to score one. Here comes one, and he'll score easily. So make it 6-3 to three now after that bloop RBI there by number 14. So bring up number 5 now. Just a three-run lead here, one out still. As Ware's going out there to have another talk with Frank, but... I don't know if he'll just be talking this time. So it looks like Wade uh, came in to, uh, or sorry for Frank here. As uh, Wade will inherit runners at every base here, one out as number five comes up to bat. Frank went over there to second base. Uh, Schmick all over here to third as he gets ready for the first pitch. Call strike 0 1. Now he gets set with the 0 and 1. Check that runner. But comes to the plate. Misses up high. 1 and 1. Now he gets set with the 1 and 1. And here comes the pitch. Ain't going to be sent out there, but it'll get foul on the first base side. Lucky break there for the Hornets. So 1 and 2 count here. 
One out. Here comes the pitch. And going to be a roller out there to third base. Schmickle is going to take the out at second base. Throw over to first. Got him at first base. Great double play turn there by Schmickle. And then uh, the throw from Bell over to first base is in time. So save the bases. Loaded situation there. Wade came in. Got the ground ball he needed. And we will go to the bottom of the sixth inning. Still leading six to three. So Anderson will start things off here in the bottom of the six for the Hornets. So he gets set with his first pitch. Call strike 0 1. So he gets set with the 0 and 1 now. And here comes the pitch. Gonna be sent out there between second and third, and that'll be a leadoff single there for Anderson. So Nick Bell will step in now. One on, no outs, and bunts one down there to third base lane. That's a perfect bunt, and I doubt they'll be able to throw him out as the throw will get away from him. Now uh, Anderson's trying to get third. Got him at third base. So they will eventually get that one out. So one out now. Nick Bell over there at first, and uh, Matt Frank comes up to bat. Now he gets set. Here comes first pitch to him, and chopper up the middle off the pitcher's glove, and... They'll be safe at every base here, so first and second out with one out. That'll bring up Schmick all now. Runners first and second, one out. We're trying to give up or trying to get back the one run they let up in the top. As they still lead by three runs here. Real good spot to do it here is Schmick all. As he gets ready, here comes the first pitch. And the dirt. Ball one. Now he gets set with the 1-0. And whoa, that comes in and hits him, so. Free pass there, gonna be bases loaded now for uh, Burger coming up. So bases loaded for Burger here. Another bases loaded situation from the Hornets. Hopefully they can capitalize again. First pitch is fly ball out there. It looks like it'll get out of play, and it will as left fielder uh, can't get that one. So 0 1 count on Burger. So it gets set with the 0 1 now. And here comes the pitch. And the dirt that gets away from him now. Here comes Bell breaking home. And down he goes. And that's going to be a slide. And he's going to get in there in time. So get that run back. Make it 7-3 to three. Hornets. It's just an outburst of runs today. And a 1-1 one and one count on Berger here. Both runners, uh, Frank and Schmidt, also advance the base. So they're at second and third now. So he gets set with a 1-1 one one count now. And here comes the pitch, and swing, but came up empty, one and two. So he gets set with one and two. Now here comes the pitch, and it's a bit low there. So two and two on Berger. So he gets set, two and two count. And here comes the pitch, and going to be a chopper out there. Second base isn't going to be able to corral that one in. And that's going to be the eighth run. And now Berger will come all the way over to second base. Good base running by him there. And that's what I was talking about earlier with the infield playing in. Uh, hard enough hit ground ball, it can just get right past you. So 8-3 to three now in favor of the Hornets. We're going to be at second and third for Helsher coming up. Just one out still here. And he gets set with it. And here comes the pitch. Going to be a little roller out there to shortstop. Shortstop's going to come home with it and gets the tag at home for out number two. And the runners will be on the corners now after that tag for uh, Messer coming up to bat here. And actually it looks like Dylan will, uh, Dylan Ox here is going to get the at bat. Two down and there goes the runner over there to second base and hit over there shortstop. Shortstop throws over for out number three. But the Hornets get a couple more runs, make it eight to three here going into the top of the seventh. Uh... Just needing three more outs here to seal the victory. So Wade will stay out there to try to close out this game. First batter he's going to see here is uh, number 11. First pitch is outside, though, 1-0. Oh. Hornets just need three outs here to seal this victory, and it'll be a real good one. Uh, down a couple runs early, but uh, as he gets set with the 1-0. and oh. And that's right across for a strike, 1-1. One one. But the Hornets... Uh, did a real good job capitalizing today. Had the bases loaded. It seemed like every time he turned around, as he gets set with the one and one. And uh, here comes the pitch. And going to be lifted out there. And that'll be a blue pit into right field. So one on, no outs here. So uh, 
But as I was saying, uh, had the bases loaded, it seemed like every time you turn around and they capitalized, got runs in almost every time off that. And that's what you got to do here as they lead 8-3 to three right now. As uh, number 10 comes up to bat with a run over there at first base. First pitch is a little bit high. 1-0. Defense has also had a real good game. A uh, bunch of double plays turned, and especially that last one uh, in the top of the six that really got us out of the jam. As the next pitch comes in, swing and miss. 1-1. One one. So good defense all around, and... Good offense so far. We just need to get three more outs here to push our record back up to 500, 6 and 6. Here comes the pitch. And going to be a roller out there at first. And that'll be a foul ball. So one and two now on them. So ahead in the count here, one and two. As that runner doesn't have too big of a lead out there at first base. Here comes the pitch. And send it out to play foul. Stay at one and two. So once again, get set with the one and two. Here comes the pitch. And going to be a roller out there to third base. Schmidt call. Uh, going to throw it to second base for one. Throw it to first. Not in time over at first, but gets that lead runner. So, a one out here. So, he gets set now as uh, number two came in. And first pitch is going to be a little bit too high there. 1-0 -oh count. Now, he gets set with the 1-0. -oh. Just two more outs needed now. And there's going to be a swing and a miss. 1-1. One -on -one. Now, he gets set with a 1-1 -one -one count. And here comes the pitch, and I'm going to blow that one by him, one and two. So one and two count now. Here comes the pitch, and going to be a roller out there. Uh, going to be thrown over to second base. Oh, but that will actually hit the runner there. So going to be uh, one out. Runners at first and second. So extend the inning here. Uh, bring up number two, Rashid. Or, sorry, uh, number 15, Wheeland, as number two, Rashid's over there at first base now. Here comes the first pitch to him, and the dirt. Nice block by Strike. And now they're going to try to get him here at third, but the throw is too high. So, runners at first and third now. Still a five run lead here for the Hornets, but having a bit of a problem closing it out. As he gets set for. Uh, Pitch here to number 15. And now he gets set with it. Here comes the pitch. And it's a little bit high. 2 and 0 oh count. So he gets set 2 and 0 oh count. Here comes the pitch. Misses inside. 3 0. -oh. So we're going to have to battle back here. Got a 3 0 -oh count. And start right there with a called strike. 3 and 1. Two outs. Don't have to worry too much about those base runners. As you are up, by, as the Hornets are up by five right now. Just really want to get a couple outs here as he gets set with the next one and pop fly, but that'll get out of play. Three and two. So he gets set with the next pitch now. And called. Strike three as the batter was already heading down to first base. Rule number one in high school baseball, and actually any baseball, never try to show up an umpire. So that's going to be. Out number two here. Runner still at first and third. As he gets set now with number seven coming in. First one is a little bit high. Ball one. Now he gets set with the one and oh. And that's in there for a call strike. One and one. So one one count here. Just need one more out to uh, get this victory. And here comes the pitch. Oh, man. Just missed there with that one. Nice little breaking ball from Wade, but couldn't get it called. 2-1 count. As he gets set with it now. Two outs, runners on the corner. Five run lead for the Hornets here in the top of the seventh. Here comes the pitch. And fouls it off, make it 2-2. Two two. So 2-2 two -two count now. Two outs in the inning. Here comes the pitch. Called strike three. That's going to do it. And the Hornets move up to 6-6 six and six on the year. And get a real good victory today, as I said, starting this inning. Real good at bats. Capitalized when we had the bases loaded. And uh, the defense really came through. Had good plays all around. And so we'll get that sixth victory of the year. Final score, IVC 3, Eureka 8.